Hey guys, welcome back to Sonic the Gunslinger and my coverage of Sage 2023. Last time we started off Sonic the Gunslinger, which is a Sonic Roboblast 2 mod that allows you to, uh, you know, play through a kind of Sonic storybook game where instead of being in like the Arabian Nights or uh, the stories of King Arthur, you're instead in the American Wild West. So, you know, last time uh, we played as Rouge, Sonic, and Fang, and messed around in a bunch of different places, but either way, we need to go to the Southern Swamp. We're here on the thing. I think I've already seen this cutscene, haven't I? You have neglected to fulfill your con I've already seen that one. Alright, so now I had to pick up with uh, Fang doing target practice or something? What the hell is this? Oh, it's a... It's, a, it's literally a swamp. I was like, huh? Like, what the hell is going on? Why is there just floating grass? But there's actually a reason for the floating grass. I didn't think there would be, but... Come on, it's the it's the jumpy shit from, uh... I forget what the name of that level is. It's the second level in regular Roboblast 2. It's the chemical plant kind of look like, and it had the purple goo that allows you to, uh... You know, do the bouncy stuff. Let's see. My best guess is that we're just, like... Break the target and beat the level without dying to go to the bonus stage. I will do that, sir, if I can actually hit it. Let's see, it's gotta be... Or I could shoot at it, I guess. Does that work? Yeah, that works. <laughs> it's like we're going to Super Smash Brothers. I've never been a big fan of Smash the Target stages. Maybe it's just because I've, like... Eh, I'm just not the biggest fan about, like, platforming in Super Smash Brothers. But I know a lot of people love the, uh... The Break the Target stages... What the hell is this? I have no clue what that is, but that's interesting nonetheless. I still have no clue what we're actually doing. He said we were going here for, like, target practice or something, so... My guess is just we're gonna kill all of the enemies, but... Then again, it... Wait, oh, there's an area that's locked off. Okay, so it's right behind here, so I'm guessing it is just a... Kill everybody. Massacre mode. The Fang Massacre. He just... Well, it's not really a massacre if you're killing robots. Do robots have lives to be counted? No, if you're robot... Robotist. Maybe you would say that. You robotist. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I will shoot this moto bug and he will die. He will die. How are there robots in the Wild West? That's one thing. Doesn't make much sense. That's why those games usually tend to, like, change the, uh... Like, the affiliation of the enemies and stuff like that. Like, they tend to, uh, be like, oh, in Sonic and the Secret Rings, they're not, like, badniks. They're, or, uh, Robo, or Eggman's robots. They're just, uh, like, weird gins and stuff like that. I mean, mostly because you're fighting a genie, but still. It's like, there are multiple different ways you could do enemies. And then in, like, the, uh, Sonic and the Black Knight, it's a bunch of, like, you know, evil knights. So it's like, maybe if you were to switch it to being like a different kind of thing, you would feel more like a storybook. Unless this is not meant to be a storybook game, it's just meant to be a game where everybody decides to become cowboys for some reason. Which is fine. That's still kind of cool, but it's like, if you're gonna go for a full storybook thing, I don't really know what you'd do. Maybe just like, cowboy inspired stuff? Like they're, maybe like, uh, just like, instead of them being like actual, like robots, have them be like animals and stuff. Like I know animals are usually meant to be like, uh, like, characters in the Sonic series, but if you use, like, you know, like, wet desert-like animals as, like, enemies, but have them be, like, ghostly figures. Like, you know, there's, like, a ton of ghost stories about the Wild West. So it's like, you know, you could do that. That'd be cool. Like, ghostly, uh, desert animals. I mean, then again, this level doesn't really scream, you know, the Wild West. It's more screams like, uh, I don't know, we're at Niagara Falls. I don't remember Niagara Falls existing in the the Wild West. So fuck you. Fuck you. I'm like, fuck you. Guess we're having to use the balloons to get over there, or... Come on. Get a good bounce. Come on. No. Ah, that was close. How the fuck am I supposed to make these jumps? Am I supposed to jump on the balloons? Fang is not known for having really amazing jumping prowess. He's, he's, the, he's the gunner. He's the, he's the, he's the fighter. Well, I didn't really shoot him, but he just died. So there's like a bunch of pillars all over these guns. My best guess is that the guns 
are the things that I'm supposed to be shooting for, not the badniks. Though shooting them does get them out of the way, so it's like, eh, at least they're gone and out of the way. Oh, it's down there? Interesting, interesting. They're definitely making me go all over the place to find these things. Uh, I guess I'll go over to this red one first. Actually, what is this saying? Not all turrets are at the same elevation. Look higher and lower to find them. Yes, sir. <laughs> Fuck you. I literally just, like, jumped down once, and it's like, oh, hi. There you go. Alright, so now I gotta find... I love looking through all these trees. It's definitely not annoying. The hell? I wonder what... Oh, wait, that's probably where one of the turrets are. It's hiding by the Eggman statue. There you go. <laughs> the music's a bit weird, isn't it? It sounds like a, uh... Just like one of those weird things. It sounds like a weird thing. You know me, I hate weird things. Especially myself. Self-loathing achieved. Is it really self-loathing if you just if you're just making a joke about it? I guess I would just be self-deprecating. Spring to climb the tower. What about the balloons? Ha! Ah, I'm cool. I'm cool is no longer cool. Let's see. Well. Okay, so we have to use the spring guy. Okay, that stop lying to me, game. That didn't launch me far enough. Ah, fuck you. The travel time of these balloons is quite insane, isn't it? I did not choose to do that. I did not choose to walk into you, Mr. Mr. Fuckhead. There you go. Who needs a fucking spring? I mean, you are a spring. Is that, is that supposed to be like a steamboat? That's, oh yeah, you can literally see the steam coming off of it. Yeah, him being stuck in place when he shoots? Yeah, that's not fun. It's probably why you need the bomb, but it's like... There we go. I skipped part of the level. If you meant for me to go all the way around, that didn't really work out. But if you didn't, then it's like, well, I still did something cool! Oh, is there not even anything up here? This is just like, oh, look. Oh, yeah, there is. There's a... In the cockpit, I guess? What would you call, I guess, just the steering area? This is the area where you steer. Just so that you know. In case you didn't know, I, I thought that the bathroom was where I steered. Oh, let me guess I have to go into the underground area again. That's that's just grand. Wait, I thought that this was a uh, uh, a beacon. That's just like a weird-ass waterfall. The weird-ass waterfall. Let's see, where do we go? I don't know. Oh, there's a entrance in there, but how do we get over there? Oh, down this way, okay. <laughs> Just a little bit more critical thinking would have worked out. See, let's not fall in the water. I don't want to have to deal with all those things trying to get out. Die. <laughs> Die! Let's see, so there is one, two, three more? And the blue, the blue thing doesn't count. Yeah, you can shoot me, but I shoot fast. Except for that when I'm stuck in water. Boing. Boing. <laughs> I just fly out of nowhere, my man. I just fly out of nowhere. Boing. Is that enough? Come on. Oh, boy. Does that? I have to climb back up the entire thing, don't I? That is just grand. I probably should have jumped down there in the first place, but I was like, eh, there's more, so much to do, so much to see. I don't want to do that shit, but I guess, you know, I have to now. Let's see. Yeah, this is a very fucking big level. Drift. There we go. I was like, drift. Sonic drift. Actually, we didn't have to do that. It's whatever. <laughs> there's another way up, but... It's fine. All right, did I got everything but the one that's near the uh, the start of the level? Also, I just decided to run into that moto bug. Oh, it's up here, so you actually had to go through that. Okay, that didn't work. Okay, so it is every enemy, or maybe I just haven't found all the beacons. This is a very long level. We're also kind of getting to the end of it, which is actually a fucking bad thing, isn't it? How do I get up? How do I get here now? 
Oh, I see it. It's on top of the water tower. They poisoned my asshole. Well, now I only have like 40 seconds to get there. How am I... Oh, I have to like ride the... Oh, no. I have to get up there. Ah, oh, come on. I'm like in the wrong area completely. That's fucking bullshit. Now, the, now I'm going to time out. I have no way of getting up there now. If only I missed it. Damn. That might have been my only chance. I'm going to time out soon. I'm going to have to do it again. This is kind of like... I don't like this level. I don't like this level at all. Whoever came up with this is an asshole, as the angry video game nerd would say. I'm going to run out of time right now. No, it actually goes into time over. Okay. That's good. Thank you, Mr. Developer. If that wasn't here, I'd be pissed. Let's see, if only I could just... If only I could get up there a lot easier than what I'm doing. All right, so I have to go all the way back through everything I just did just to get up there. That's a little bit. That's a little bit of bullshit, but that's mostly on my on my bad. I just have to spring across the level like a fucking asshole. Come on. Come on. <laughs> you must spring, Fang. You are the springy man. Oh no, and then I think I can go around all of these, so it should be fine. Thank God that there's no overtime, at least in this level, at least. Let's see. Mm, got a little bit knocked off trail, but I'll make it there. I don't know if this is actually faster or if running is better, but it always felt like running as Fang is a lot slower, so. There we go. Alright. Don't miss. Whew. Now he's got to get out of here. Oh, God. Okay, I'm going to have to use this little spring. There we go. I guess that counts. And I also heard something go off, so my best guess is that's the uh, the force field going down. Yep. Super spring! <laughs> it actually kind of does work. Like, the, the height you take into the spring does get in into account. Also, there's just some egg robos. Like, give me some emotional support, I guess. All right, what's going on next? Oh, yeah, I have the this. I was like, I forgot I have the this. Wait, why is Amy here? Is Amy in the next? Oh, I get it. She's supposed to be like a, uh, an obstacle. She's supposed to be what gets in the way to stop you. I get it. Unless it's going to be part of the next level, which is going to be very odd. Okay. Good job, Fang. You are now in Psychedelic Candyland. I wonder if you have to get, like, the bonus in every stage to do something, but I have no clue. Sonic, uh, Jesse James, you need to get out of town and find the safe house. In the meantime, I'll infiltrate Eggman's mansion and find out what his real plan is. I'm looking for intel. I'm sure Eggman keeps his madcap plans written down somewhere. And if he happens to leave his valuables lying around, too, well... I'll just help myself. He won't be able to do it. He keeps all of his plans in his Blackberry. Nobody uses a fucking Blackberry anymore. I also hit the mic. I'm sorry. It's because my chin is very itchy. Okay, so we're actually playing like a Sonic Adventure style, like, treasure hunting stage. That's actually pretty fucking badass. I always love those stages. Everybody's like, I hate those stages. They're so annoying. And it's like, you know, I love them. So, you can go suck head. Sick. Now we just have to, you have to, you have to have knowledge of the level to understand everything that's going to happen. So it's like, you have to be knowledgeable. If you ain't, then you get fucked. Let's see. This is interesting. Ooh. Up on here? Oh, I see it. That's an emerald? Uh, let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out. I was like, let me out, let me out, let me out. Is it that? Isn't... Okay, he wasn't able to recolor the, uh... The emeralds, but... You know, it's whatever. Now you just fly around. There's a fucking tennis court. And a... A ring launch? It's an interesting estate. Oh, I'm getting close. Come on. 
Is it inside the building, maybe? Oh, no, I see it. Alright, there's one last emerald to find. I have a feeling this has been like the Adventure 2 style. Which, when I get to Adventure 2, I'll talk about Adventure 2, but a lot of people don't like that style. Is it in the barn? Oh, I see it. See, that's why I love these levels. I love treasure hunting levels. I didn't even know that this, that Rosa Robles 2 could even do that. So that's pretty badass. Ooh, who's there? Calamity Jade? What are you doing here? After all these years, as the town's most honest bank manager, you're looting my mansion? No matter. Take the money and go. Wait. What's that behind your back? That's my private notebook. My top secret stories. My trademark tall tales. You can't take that. No? All right, then. Face the wrath of my egg tower. Face the wrath of my egg cock. And versus the egg cock. Okay, so now we just have to beat up all the enemies. This is interesting... There you go. You're easily defeated. I'm actually going to be doing a lot better because I can actually, you know, kill the enemies nicer. Just don't break the, uh, the Eggman capsule. There are a lot of them around, it looks like. There you go. You can't fucking stop me. I'll blow up little Jimmy over here as well. There you go. Oh, invincibility. That's probably nice. Let's see. Are they all dead? They're all dead on this floor. Might need to go down and kill everything down here. I did not mean to do that big old bounce, so that was cool. Get over your assholes. Run into my greatness. There you go. <laughs> you shouldn't have given me that invincibility. That was that might have been a little bit too good. Climb the vines to access each level of the tower. There are three levels. Okay, well I've got level one and level two down. This has been a lot more fun than uh what was it, Fang's boss fight? Mostly because he had, a, like, a giant arena to deal with. Let's see. Like, the, the fight against Fang, not the one where Fang fights uh, Eggman. That one was just kind of stupid. That one was pretty easy. He's pretty stupid. <laughs> Die. There you go. Is there another? Is there another one? Is there, like, another level I don't know about? Or maybe... I, forget, I think he's at the middle level, ain't he? Oh. Well, that's open. Oh, shit. Let me up. Oh, it's... I have to try and, like, actually hit into him. This is interesting. Oh, I won the level. Oh, good thing I didn't fall into that hole. That would have been real bad. But yeah, that, that boss fight was fine. Mostly easy. Sounds like Fang is hot on my heels. I've got to get out of here. The train tracks lead out of town. And Calamity Jane said that there's a safe house at the end of the line. I can't wait around to buy a ticket, though. Sounds like it's time for some serious train hopping. Oh. I don't like trains. Trains have always scared me. <laughs> they go so fast. Except for all the other things that go fast in life. Okay, so I'm running down the tracks, I guess. Kind of reminds me of the, uh, again, of the western level in the game. Hopefully it's not as bullshit. Now I'm back to playing Sonic in his stupid double jump, though it has helped me more than it's fucked me over in uh, this playthrough, so. Maybe it's not as bad as I think it is, but, like, still. Still gonna complain, because I like the Fox so much. What does it say? Jump on the lever to open the red gate. Oh. There we go. Oh, no. A little bit more platforming, eh? There we go. <laughs> I mean, that's a kind of a cool gimmick, like trying to get onto this stuff. What could this be? Maybe we need a gear? Hmm. Or just hit that. <laughs> I was like, maybe we need to put a gear here. It's like, no, you just need to hit the stupid thing. That's like, oh, okay. Maybe there's a time frame to it? Oh, it's a train. <laughs> it's a weird looking train. Alright then. Good good dynamite. I barely noticed it was there. 
But yeah, that was that's a weird looking train. I don't remember trains being green and red. Unless you're, I guess, fucking Santa Claus. Who wants to go watch the Polar Express with me? I don't. I don't even want to watch it with myself. That movie was really weird. It had Tom Hanks in it, I guess, which is, I guess, an up in some ways, but, like, I don't really give a shit. <laughs> like, I don't really give a shit at all. Like, it was always kind of, like, a weird movie when I was a kid. Like, the voice acting was always pretty fucking cringe, and, like, nobody had names. <laughs> nobody had a fucking name. So it's like, I don't know who any of you fuckers are. I guess I could jump over into that area, but nah. We're taking we're taking it normal this way. So you could have gotten like a uh, a break the target thing, but you know, trying to do that with Sonic's like momentum is like no good. I ain't doing that. There we go. No, don't fall off. Is this like ice? Even though it's supposed to be like oil. Why are there like oil stacks in the middle of the the west? Oh my! Oh now it tells me like go down. Yes. Oh, apparently I fell on a train. I don't remember that. Trigger the switches and find the minecart. What? We're looking for a minecart? I thought we were on a train. You've lied to me for the last time, game. You've lied to me about trains and minecarts and all that other shit. What the hell? That works. <laughs> I was like, that works. Let's see. I mean, this is kind of fun. I like the whole idea of train hopping. I just... Why are trains green? <laughs> Why are they green? I remember them being like, you know, mostly brown or gray, maybe. Oh, okay. Come on, there you go. It's like the minecart sections from the Western level. It's just like so much worse because there's these in the way. It's not even killing me, it's just like <laughs> it's not even killing me. It's just being a dickhead to me. Come on! <laughs> this is fucking stupid. Ah, the timing to get that thing is a little bit too tight. Okay, somehow that something? Alright then. I'm just gonna learn to accept it. Who needs that? Lower tunnel open. We don't talk about any other lower tunnels that are opening, damn it. We don't know. We should never know. Okay, where in the blue hell am I going? Uh, magnet shield? Uh, let's see, a one-up. I don't know where to... I guess I'll just go this direction now. I at least like how open the stages are. They're not, like, completely linear. Which is really nice. Got a lot of cool set pieces, like blowing up the dam and jumping across trains. But it always... it, it does seem to confuse me in ways. Because I'm a confused man. Let's see. Upper bridge open. Not sure where that is, but thanks for the thanks for the ride. Let's see. Oh no. Just jump up there. <laughs> Just this little ledge helps me. I guess I don't get as many rings, but then again, don't have a need for them all that much. Also, am I right at the beginning? So where am I? <laughs> Leap of faith, I guess. Oh, you don't want to... I'm going to guess you don't want to jump into the oil using the, uh... The fire shield. That's probably a bad idea. Unless that's supposed to be, like, a different kind of thing, but... You know, I'm going to take a guess. It's not good. Oh, shit! If shit blows up, I'm dead. See, I heard the ring. Oh, there it is. Let's see. I guess that's the safe house, even though it doesn't seem that safe. It seems like there's enemies all around. Safe house has been compromised. Go to the whorehouse instead. That's uh, that actually might be what Rouge was meaning. <laughs> well now, looks like uh, Son and Jesse James is on the run. I'd say that's a job well done. What? I reckon I should head into town to collect my dues. But I doubt Wild Egg Kickoff plans to make good on his end of the bargain. Of toboggan. You know, a little bad. Uh, Birdie told me that Eggman runs a carnival around here. What say we loot some of its fun, just in case he don't pay up? Call it insurance if you like. Now, that sounds real good. 
Unlike your voice acting. <laughs> Sorry, man. Either way, uh, apparently he says that's a job well done. I say that's wrong. That's not a job well done. That's a, do that's a job shit done. You didn't kill him. <laughs> you sat around and said, hey, you, you suck. And then he left, and you're like, man, that I did good. <laughs> it's like, no, you didn't. No, you did not. He had 400 rings to access the gold ring. Find a gold attraction. So it's kind of like uh, doing... Uh, what is that? It kind of reminds me of Ni Carnival Night. No, not Carnival Night. It's a level from Shadow the Hedgehog where you have to capture 400 rings as part of one of the good missions. Hmm. Well, where the hell... I this is really, really kind of boring. Don't hit me! I don't want to lose the rings I've already accrued. Amy? What the fuck's Amy doing here? It's like a hug me zone. Fang actually looks pretty pretty happy about this. We should just let him stay here. Anyway, we gotta go. We gotta go, chick. Boop. There we go. Uh, okay, we can find some like ring containers, but 400 rings seems like quite a lot to get. And we only have like five minutes? Damn. I have no clue where to go to get 400 fucking rings. Maybe up there? I just gotta look for as many uh, ring monitors as I can. Ooh, this'll be useful. This will be a lot better than just whatever the hell I've been doing. There we go. That way I can actually uh, collect as many rings as possible. This might be a little bit easier now. Especially with this thing. Though they are just like singular rings. So it's like, uh, it's not a great way of getting a million rings. But it'll work. Ah, come on, asshole. How was I supposed to know? That that would... I guess I never... That you never really have a... Uh, a magnet shield while you're uh, in any kind of goop areas, so it's never been something that I've ever really experienced in the game to be like, oh, that's fucking bullshit, nothing ever told me that, but I guess technically you should think of that because you shouldn't jump into water with the shield in Sonic 3, but it's like, the game never told me that something about like that, so. Let's see, what could be up here? Hmm, I don't know. Maybe I was supposed to, like, use the springs to, like, do something about that. Like, hit the springs, then hit the, uh... No, I have no clue. Oh, shit, I lost it. Motherfucker. You motherfucker. Are the... Oh, it's sapping rings from me. That's what that noise is. Okay, let's... I think that's fine. Okay, don't go in there. That shit's a fuck face. Let's see, we only have three minutes to collect as many rings as we can. This is fucking... This is a little bit hectic, ain't it? Trying to get as many as possible. Then Fang can't really run in a straight line for some odd reason. Probably could have used the Jetter. To reach the slot machines, you'll need a well-timed jump. If you can't make it, collect the other things. Okay, then. I'm like, uh, right? I still feel like it's kind of hard to get all the rings I need. Feels like I'm <laughs> I'm having to like run back every five seconds to collect another shield because I'm like repeatedly losing it, and it's like kind of the only good way I can get stuff. But I think I can only get about half the rings, unless I could somehow get like a really good jump on those like things because I have no clue how to get up there. Let's see, collect as many rings as possible. I got 200 rings, which is nice. Hmm. Oh, there's a, there's another magnet shield in there, or whatever the hell the game wants to call them. I don't know what uh, the actual Roboblast 2 likes to call the uh, the ma the lightning shield. Unless they do just call it the lightning shield. Hey, Amy, I'm going to run around and grab as much as I can. Seems like there's shit over there. There we go. Can't jump over that area. Hmm. Interdesting. How am I going to get on top of there now? Oh, there's a ton of shit on top of the, uh, the fucking Ferris wheel. Oh, fuck you. I'm like, fuck you. Fang doesn't do jumping all that well. He does this, and while it's useful for land coverage, it's not really useful for height. Also, I'm, like, halfway below my time. Oh, no. Let me see. Ugh. I'm just not sure what the... What in the bloody hell I'm supposed to do with these? 
Am I supposed to, like... I have no clue. I have no clue. Hi. No, I lost it again. No, don't take my rings. I need to collect as many as I can. This is bullshit. This is bullshit. How am I supposed to collect them all like this? <laughs> okay. Alright, so I just need about 60 rings. Uh, 50 rings, actually. Well, that's going to be a little bit tough to get. Stay on, you asshole. Let's see. Collecting that many rings in this amount of time is not going to be great. Since I've pretty much taken up all of the other uh, areas, and I don't have any more, like, uh, what is it? It's shields to use. Let me see, is that a shield? Yep. I remembered it was in here. How am I going to get the rest, though? Hmm. Let's see. Might be able to use it through here. I need, like, nine more. That's going to be a bit of a problem. Because I don't have much time left before I need to go back to the goal ring. Come on. Will I be able to collect... <gasps> I see one. Alright, let's go. Go, 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 go. I did it. <laughs> Glitched the shit out of the screen, but it worked. That was close. I pretty much, like, used up all my time doing that. Sonic, I got a hold of Eggman's secret documents. We got it all wrong. Fang wasn't meant to be a deadly threat. Eggman just wanted you to run away. Wild Egg Hickok is a storyteller. He wants to drive you from town to town and tell everyone he did away with you. He'll restart the story and do it over and over again. You have to come back and confront him. He's inviting robots from other fictional dimensions. Hey, maybe you can catch a ride on their UFOs. Okay. So, his plan was to use us as a... I don't know, as a tall tale teller? So we're going into town. Green UFOs flip gravity upside down, but the yellow ones flip gravity back up again. Um... Sir, I have a problem. It's called gravity. Yeah, I did not like them at Egg Rock. I'm probably not going to like them here. Oh, boy. How was I even... Okay. I was just unable to see that there would be more areas to land on. Yeah, I can't really, like... Come on, kill. Oh, boy. I think they're kind of fucked up. Their gravity doesn't work that much anymore. There's bees... I hate the bees! I also hate gravity. Fly through gravity. Just fly through a Earth plan. You'll need to jump under some UFOs. Trigger a flip. Take this jump slowly. Well, whatever. I guess I'm down here now. Oh, so I pretty much just, like, reversed my existence. Okay, well, that's... <laughs> That's not annoying at all. I hate gravity flipping, especially in Sonic Robo Blast 2. It just doesn't work well. Like, it instantly flips instead of, like, showing me that the gravity is flipping. It's just, like, it instantly happens. It's like, that's... <laughs> I would like to... Dude. Dude. Come on! Stay on! There we go. Stay on, Sue Snack the Sweet Swag. Alright. <laughs> is that all... Can we not do any more gravity shifting? That's just not fun. God damn you. I'm like, God damn you. Oh, I can't really make it there, but whatever, I guess. Also, why is there an oasis in, like, I don't know, New Mexico? I don't remember any oasis is happening in New Mexico. Happening, yes. Let's see, how the, where the balls do I go? I guess the game's just telling me run in circles, I guess. Okay. Now, where the hell am I heading now? Oh, okay. That's not fun. <laughs> I'm like, that's not fun. Especially if these pterodactyls, like, grab at me. Because, like, if they grab at me, they'll pick me up and throw me wherever the hell they want me to go. And it's like, that's not fun. Also, I guess the gravity's not doing well with the, uh... The boxes. Am I going the wrong way? I guess I was. How was I supposed to fucking know? 
It looked like they wanted me to go this direction, but I guess not. You lied to me. You lied to me, game. To jump out of the way there. Come on. Why was I stuck by a pole? How could I be stuck by a pole? Oh, no. Okay, I barely made that one. Oh, I hate gravity puzzles. They're bullshit. I hate them. Where am I going now? I guess that way. <laughs> I'll follow the arrows on the ground. Who the hell etched the arrows on the ground? Don't know, but Sonic really loves them. Mm. Yeah, I don't remember going to the botanical gardens. I don't... I'm kind of confused about that one. I love the botanical gardens. Never actually been to a botanical gardens. Heard they're pretty, I guess. Depends on which one you go to, I guess. Don't touch the blue laser beam, but why? I love blue laser... That sounds like a really shitty band. Like a really shitty Sonic cover band. Blue laser. How the fuck do you hit that? Oh shit, he just, he, he green arrowed me. Hit me with his bow. Where am I going now? There? Oh! Oh! Sorry, it sounded like I ejaculated. Sorry, the game was just like, oh, you want to die? Mm, avoid all boosters, I don't want to be thrown off. But it looked like I was literally just going to die there. Like, it looked like there was no fucking chance of survival. But it was like, oh, I guess I'm okay now. <laughs> I guess I'm okay now. Where the hell am I going? Here? I think I know where I'm going. There we go, hit it. Okay, I'm doing okay. Also, I can hear the goal ring, so. Seems like we're at least close enough to start hearing things. Am I supposed to kill all the thingies, or are these just here to piss me off, I guess? Let's see. There we go. I know that that thing loves to push me off and throw me into the ground, so I ain't gonna pull that shit. Hmm, that's just the underneath, okay. Let's keep a move on. Let's keep a move on. Wait, what? Oh. I'm, like, taking the upper path now. Where am I? I don't know where the hell I am, but I'm being whisked all over the place. So it seems like this entire level is, like, a big circle, and it's just like, oh, the, uh, uh the, the gold ring's, like, right in the middle, and you gotta find it. Let's see. There we go. That was close. I don't know which path was safer, but I'm going to take the, the riskier path. Or I, I wasn't looking for the path that was safer. I was looking for the path that would actually bring me somewhere. Whew. Okay, where the hell am I? Uh, I'm guessing I just have to retreat through the same area I just went over. Okay. 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 I mean, I like this level. This level has a lot of creativity. It's just like, my brain cannot function properly. Okay, somehow I made it to the, the thing, I guess. Oh, damn, there's explosives all over the place. Eggman really doesn't want me going home. Oh, wait, Eggster, I'm here. Whoa. Yeah. Damn, that was a hard level, but it was fun. <laughs> I say it so boredly, like, that was fun. Sonic. Supposed to be driven out of town by Pang. With you, the notorious Jesse James out of the picture, I'd have become sheriff. I'd have been rewarded for cleaning up this town. But no matter. I have a backup plan. Call it nuke. I've set up a duel, and not just any duel. A special duel to see who's the deadliest. Okay, I get your reference. All right, you two. Ten paces and turn. Did I even agree to a duel? Also, Sonic Riders reference. I want to play the game that will tell me if I'm the, 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 the gameliest. Uh, take him down in 45 seconds. What? Yeah, it's not all that great. Because I can't really aim at him all that well. 
Get on your asshole. See, my, my spin dash is like real shit. I win! Even though all I did was run in circles like a madman. Sonic just really wanted to enter the saloon. He wants some fucking vodka. We don't sell vodka here, partner. We only got... Cum. Damn it. <laughs> Say, Jesse James, uh, Sonic, I got no problem with you personally. I just only have a problem with Say you mentally. call a truce and turn on Eggman instead. If we take him out, you get to go on your merry way. And I get the money that was part of your bounty contract. You agree? Well, boy, howdy. Here I go. Well, boy, howdy. Here I go. See, I could have voice acted. You agree? I want you. <laughs> Just play, uh, what is it? Fucking, uh, the Mater thing. I want you. Oh, I have to fight fucking Metal Robotnik. He was like the worst boss fight in fucking, uh,. In the main game, so I guess I just have to shoot at his ass. Eggman, you're gonna die. How's that sound? He's like, no, I don't like that. Well, does not suck, Eggster. Shouldn't have been such an egg. Okay, so uh, everything is death. Okay, that's good to know. How am I supposed to get up there now after I've jumped down? Okay, somehow he flooded the town. I think I don't. I, you don't really want him to be your sheriff anymore after he's like destroyed all your your crops and shit because most uh, people in the wild west were farmers settlers it's me and you old man and my name is F F frangy I have to get up there a million fucking times to shoot you in the ball sack your balls aren't gonna be too happy when I stab them multiple times using a spork <laughs> Why specifically a spork? I have no clue. I did not choose to do that. I'm like, I did not ask for that. Oh, sometimes I can hit him while he's just like kind of by the edge of the arena. No, stop that. I'm like, no, no, bad boy. I did not mean for that to happen. No, bad boy. Bad boy. You're a bad boy. Yes, you are. Then again, Fang is like the best person to fight. Like... Metal Robotnik, since, like, you know, I've got range, I don't have to deal with him getting close and up and, like, fucking me. The worst part is when you take his middle pee pee. You're gonna die? <laughs> is you gonna die now? I'm gonna guess this is the final boss. You're blowing up. A, what are you gonna do with the bomb? Huh? Why are you throwing them into nothingness? I guess he doesn't really understand that I'm not anywhere near the bomb. Or maybe he's just gone completely insane and does not know how to stay still. Oh, I guess he's dead. <laughs> I'll make you pay for this. I'll make you pay for this. Dies. He will make me pay by paying life insurance. Exactly. <sighs> Thank goodness. That takes care of Wild Egg Hickok. The town is safe. Huh? Hey, you. The one behind the screen. You talking about me? I'm going home. I want out of here. But I found something when I was digging through Eggman's documents. Could there be more to the story? Only Super Sonic knows. Okay. Thanks for at least telling me. Sonic and the Gunslinger. A mod for SRB2 by Metal Harbor. Voice cast. Jet for Sonic slash Jesse James. Cashlin Snow for Rouge. Cal Yoshikawa. Uh, Yoshika for uh, Fang, Dante Majors for Eggman. I'm sorry, Cal. You need to work on your confidence in voice acting. Get a bit more confidence, I think you'll be doing great. Just be be more booming with your voice. Maybe. It depends on what kind of betrayal you want, but I'd say, eh, voice was a bit quiet. I could hear every other voice actor a bit more. Just talk a bit louder, I'd say. Anyway. Uh... Mods featuring open mods by Cozy Raff, Demix Oixfer, Onyxfer, Tetsuru, uh, Master Disaster 64. I thought it was gonna be 69. There's a lot of mods being put in here. Curb. Is it Curbifer? No, probably not. There's a lot 
of people who worked on it. And thank you to everybody who worked on it. Now, I'm probably not going to go through the uh, supersonic form. Because I have no clue how to get the Chaos Emeralds. So, I don't really know how I could actually do that. Because I have, like, the game hasn't told me yet. And I haven't found any of the, uh, like, the medals you need to get into them. So, we're going to have to skip that part. But this has been a really fun mod to play through. Like, some of the levels were, like, misses. But I think I had a ton of fun with pretty much everything here. So, I think it was also a really cool idea to use more storybook settings. Because there's been... Only two games for that, and there really should be more, because it's, like, a cool idea to bring more things into that. So, it's like, I don't know. You're capitalizing on an idea that Sega just has not been smart enough to capitalize on correctly. So, good on you. Thanks for playing. Well, thank you for making, I guess. Are you going to tell me how to get the Chaos Emeralds, or are you going to tell everybody here how to get them? Speeding off to the level. To level. A Sonic. After me? Bang. The sniper. Was it meant to be a deadly threat? And there's more ahead. A special duel to see what his real plan is. At the end of the line. Chaos Emeralds. Your last way out. Epilogue. Huh? I'm starting to remember. This is where Calamity Jane and I stashed the emeralds for safekeeping. I need to collect them and touch the altar. Oh. So I guess we're forced to collect the Chaos Emeralds. Oh, okay. Well, if that's going to happen, we're going to have the end of episode here. So I guess we're not ending yet. I thought we were ending, but I guess not. So for the final episode on Sonic and the Gunslinger, hopefully we'll get all the Chaos Emeralds and see the final ending. Because it seems like this game is actually complete, so... I guess I was wrapping up here. I guess that one might be a very short episode. So, I'll see you guys next time on Sonic the Gunslinger and my coverage of Sage 2023. And before I end this episode, I want to thank all of my YouTube members, including the True Epsilon, Swordman, the Disciples of Epsilon, Phoenix, 100,000 Triggers J, Shellbagon and Hummus, Darcy Lanfranco, Stardrum, The Sword is Still in the Stone, Crimson, Freddy, and Yuki. Without you all, this channel wouldn't stay afloat. So thank you for all your support, and I'll see you guys next time!